Hey guys, this is Charman here with uh, another secret tutor door tutorial, and uh, this one I like. It's it's not so much a secret door. It's I mean it could be turned into one, but I like just using it as a cool piston door. Um, you can just walk over, and uh, I think it pr looks pretty nice in like a little. I just made a little fake house thing, um, and not only is it uh, cool for like just using a regular piston door. You can also turn it into a trap pretty easy and uh, that's just by removing the floor and putting some lava in there so if you do do that you can just see it it's pretty hard not to fall into it so and you can't get back out unless you break stuff so um, so there's a lot of different things you can do with this but it's just a pretty simple uh, piston door to work with so I'll show you how to do it so um, I'm just gonna start over here find a nice little empty space. So I'm just gonna make a wall and um, basically what you need to do is is just get a, a wall that ha it has to be like at least three wide if you want to hide all the wiring for it. So just put um, two pistons, sticky pistons. Oh yeah you'll need um, like all this material in my um, in my uh, little hotkey here but uh, you won't need the lava if you're not making a trap. You also I don't think you need a redstone repeater unless if you're making it pretty far, like a pretty big door or something like that. Um, also, these are just my building materials, the sandstone and some bricks. So you won't really need all of it, but you'll need probably most of it. So actually, I need to put this here. So you just need um, a three wide uh, wall to place everything in. And I'm going to make sure that all the wiring is covered up. So you're just going to want to place a redstone torch down there and uh, put a piece of redstone on top of it so it powers both. So you do that on both sides. And you just go like that. And you're going to want to cover it up. Uh, it, if you want to make it a trap, you should probably use like clean stone and uh, stone pressure plates because I think that blends in the most so that you like don't see the pressure plate or whatever. I mean, it's a lot of different things you can do to make it like more like harder to know that it would be a trap because right now it it either just looks like a weird wall or if you know that like piston doors look like this then you'll know, oh, that's probably a piston door and if you go in there then it just you just fall in. So, um basically what I'm doing is like that so I know it's down there when I tunnel under and uh you're gonna want to go just underneath it here until you find. Whoops, went one too low. You want to find your redstone torch that you placed. So just want one too low. So uh, you're gonna want to go over here and find where I made that hole. See, that's where the step is. So basically, what you need to do is, if you want to make it a trap, leave this underneath these. Uh, the two parts where the pistons open and close. You want to leave this open so that you can put lava under it or whatever you want. But for this, um, I'm just gonna leave it. Um, I'm gonna leave a wall, uh, thing there for you to walk on. So uh, you want to go on both sides, and I didn't put anything here. So you want to go like that, and uh, just put redstone underneath those two things, and that's where you're gonna put pressure plates up here. So it powers the, the that redstone there so you put pressure plates on both sides there we go and go back down here and uh, you're just going to go like this and have it power or deactivate that when it, uh, when it gets activated it'll deactivate this that way it'll deactivate the piston and it'll open up the door so just connect all this redstone I'm going to break this for a second so I can walk over here but you want to find the other one and do the same thing. There we go. And you just want to close that up. Go back out. Go like that. Put your pressure plates back on. And when you go through, there we go. It opens up the door and um, it all works. See, from both sides, like that. So if you want to do the little trap thing, I'll show you. You just want to break both of these and fall down there. Um, this doesn't have to be connected, but uh, you can if you want to. And basically, you just want to make a hole or do whatever you want. Like you could make it have be like a secret entrance if you break that or something. You could do a lot of different things with it. But uh, 
Just put lava down there. And then we're gonna go out through here. There we go. And uh, when you go down there, if you close up these two sides, you won't be able to fall in there. You'll just fall straight down in there, and you won't be able to get out. So, this is a pretty easy piston door. Um, I hope you guys like it. Uh, it's, it's pretty self-explanatory. It's not too hard to make. It's pretty easy to fit inside of a house. It just takes up one little extra block to cover it. Uh, I, I like this. I get to use it a lot. And, um, just fell in my trap again. Didn't even know. <laughs> but, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Um, there will be more tutorials and other content coming out soon. Uh, hope I deserved your like and favorite. Also, if you like these, uh, tutorials and other Minecraft videos, be sure to subscribe to our channel. This is Charmin. See you guys later.